Hey, what's going on, dudes? It's Mitch, or Beijing Canadian here with episode 65 of Pixelmon. I think you dudes are really going to enjoy this one. Jerome and I are back from Atlanta, Georgia. We were there with a really cool opportunity, and uh, hopefully there'll be some more information on that down in the future. But for now, I'm going to leave it at that. We had a lot of fun and enjoyed ourselves, so big thanks to the Coca-Cola team. Back playing Gunners and Ryan, and uh, word. <laughs> Apart from that, I think... I will see you dudes all later. Yeah, I'm going a, I'm to a go to sleep. I'm really tired. <laughs> I'm not really got sleep in a few days here. So I'll see you dudes later. Goodbye. Yeah! Mitch, buddy. What is a drone? I know what we're doing this episode. Was that surfing some cow? Well, uh, we could we could surf the column, but no, even better. What's that? We're gonna get ourselves a Nido King. Oh, really? King of the Nidos. <laughs> oh, I forgot to heal my Pixelmon. I made some new Ultra Balls, but completely blanked on that one. Whoops. Wow, you just jacked what was gonna evolve my Nidoran. Oh, I'm sorry. Wow. He fought me. I didn't choose to fight him. You See, are a one of a kind, but Jerome, the Thug Life doesn't choose me. There we go. Uh, I chose it. I said that completely wrong. I'm done. Yeah, I was going to say, you just completely butchered that quote, buddy. I know, I know. It's because I'm not a thug. I'm a polka trainer. So you're a thug? Yeah. Oh, by the way, I never got to show you this. Check it out. Mm -mm. Look. I don't trust you. I don't trust him. you. He's a big island. Oh my god, he is a big island. <laughs> Torterra! Hey Guess who just started off and got himself the Nidorino after one battle? I don't know. Who did that? I think his name is Jerome. I could be wrong, though. Let me see. Wait. <laughs> Wait, no, I'm not wrong. Oh, my God. Wow, that's quite the coincidence. Nice. Congratulations. Thank you, buddy. I got something else to show you. Oh, baby. All right, here we go. Nidorino, and then Mitch Moonstone. Bada boom. Hold on, hold on, I'm not there yet for the fun. It's too late, I already used it. <gasps> You're a monster. Ah, talk about a productive episode right off the bat. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. Already moonstoning it up. Yeah, buddy. Okay, where are you hiding? Oh, there you are. Hey, little buddy. Mitch? Yeah. I'm that's scared. Good. He looks very angry. Very angry? How angry? Well, do you want to see him? Yeah, I do, but give me a second. But, Mitch, I'm impatient. I know, but give me give me oh, a hot sack. He is not as big as I thought. He's, he's as tall as me. <laughs> what the heck? Where is this? How many of these did I catch? <laughs> You're not there. Mitch. Yes. You're taking too long. Too late. No! Oh, there it is. Oh, that was obvious. I'm selling them to the fishermen. Okay, Bigums, I'm here. Too late. No. Too late to smell. Oh, Josh. Oh, no. Run from this marine. Yeah. Too strong. I'm going to spend the rest of the episode trying to get my dragon into a dragon Oh, Mitch, here you go. Oh, Let's my go. God. Things keep fighting me. Flaff, go away. There you go, buddy. See? Oh, oh, oh. Pixelmon Pokedex. Look, at, look how small oh, he is. Oh, he's, he's, he's pretty cool looking, though. He's tiny. No, he's awesome looking. He's tiny. Awesome looking. Nido King. So all we need is Nido Queen. That's and... true. Well, no, all we need is another Moonstone. Hey, Bigums. So... Drum, yeah. drum, drum, drum. What's wrong? Where'd you run to? I'm over here. Over where? I don't know. I saw Farfetch going for a dip in the water. I'm like, okay, that seems reasonable. <laughs> so I decided to fight him. Okay. Well, I got something to show you. You got another Moonstone, didn't you? No, I got something to show you, but I don't... I'm just gonna tell. Oh, there you are. Yay! Oh my! Stop fighting me! You're level seven, buddy. Yeah, I look at it. Level fifty-two. Oh my God! It's the shiny flare, Marip. I know, isn't it awesome? Are you gonna get a chief flare of your own? Ah, uh, but I like his shiny little sheep. That's what I'm saying. Are you gonna get a, your own chief flare? Never. But I got something else to show you that I that I discovered last oh, time. God. Now, nah, now nah, you got me worried, Mitch. Because, hold on. Oh, stop fighting me! Your things are such low levels. Stop. No, you. There's gotta be a way to make that not happen. Okay. I want. 
this one to come with me for a second. Which and one? I need to grab something over here. Beep, 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 beep. Well, I'm just at the Pokemon Center for whenever you're ready. I know, I know. I'm almost there. Sorry, I need this. Wait a second. Wait, wait. What the heck? I'll just make one then. Fine. Wow. Way to take the not-so-lazy way out. Okay. <laughs> I think you're going to be impressed when you see what I'm doing. Alrighty. Well, I'm at the Pokemon Center. Where are you? I'm almost there. I'm coming around. Making my way downtown. Oh, that's a big Taurus. Oh, there you are. All right, hey, ready? Man. Look. Yeah. Regular Mareep. Oh, sorry. That's a shiny one. Regular. Shaved. Wait, what? You can shave him? Why doesn't that work? What the heck? What? Shiny shaved. You can shave Mareep? Yeah. They're shaved. Just, do they, oh, they grow back or? I, I, they're just shit. Yeah. Depending on how I look at the Mareep, he has wool and he doesn't. I know. It's, it's so, so annoying. I, Keep stay naked. Wait, how did you find out you could do this? Because I, I after I caught the shiny Mareep, I looked it up to see what a shiny Flaff would look like, see if I want to evolve him. Mitch, try and shave my chief. Chief. Can't. Mm. Can't shave the chief. Guess that's why they call him the chief, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it makes complete sense. I mean, you wouldn't go up to you wouldn't go up to chief of the Cherokees and just start shaving him. So makes sense. Makes complete <laughs> sense. Yeah. So I. I, I know what a Chief Flaff looks like shiny, and it's not that impressive. But, I don't know what a shiny Ampharos looks like, so I'm gonna do it anyways. Evolve! Dude, Ampharos? We, there's no Ampharos, remember? I know, but when he gets added. Oh. You see, you see. I am curious, actually. I'd like oh, to know. Oh, he's evolving. I guess I already did it. <laughs> you did it? Yeah. Jesus. What level does he evolve at? I can't even remember. I've had him on for so long. 15, I guess. Oh, wow. And wait till the disappointment sets in where you love him more and more, but realize he can't evolve to his final form. I know. Shiny Chief Laugh! Look at yeah, how yeah, unepic buddy. that was. Hey, don't talk about Chief Laugh that way. Just come take a look. You'll see. I want to well, compare him to your Chief. Let me see. I'm, I'm in the middle of fighting a Sea King. This is very intense, Mitch. No, it's not. You're lying. Not as intense as a Shiny Chief Laugh, okay? That may be true, but it's probably not. All okay. right, yeah, what's up? Let me see. Throw yours over there. I think the tail might be a different color or something. Wait, is that really the shiny? That's like... Yay, I have a different color tail. Wow, you were better off keeping him <laughs> uninvolved. I know. I get trolled. Every shiny I get is just... Wow, it just like really gets worse and uh, worse. At least you've gotten shinies though, right? Yeah, I mean, the Magikarp is about as dope as a shiny gets. That magic card, uh, yeah, that is true. That's probably number one. I had high hopes for Chief Flaff because the shiny Mareep is pretty cool. But yeah, no, but shiny, you, you really can't beat your shiny magic card. I know, but Cause... but the Chief is like, how would anyone like you would never notice the difference unless you had them side by side. Like it's a little tail color. Like why couldn't they make the the white fur he's got? All shiny, like kind of like the Mareep, where it's all purple and flashy. Well, like I said, there's one that just changes the eye color of the Pokemon. It's like, what? Well, I just changed the, the, the tip of the tail. Like, that's pretty pretty disappointing. Yeah, actually, that's pretty bad, not going to lie. Yeah. Not going to sugarcoat it for you, buddy. Yeah. It's pretty bad. But at least I got them shinies. Or so you think. I only need three more, and I can have a full party. No, stop it. I don't... I want you to fight Jagmaster, I wanted to... Ugh. <laughs> Come, Come here, here Snorlax. Hey, Snorlax. Alright, do I need to evolve anything? That is the question. Yes. And I think I might have to, for Sea King. I'm trying to remember. I got a horsey, so I'll take him out. Take him out, for the moment. Perfect. If you status effect a Snorlax, it's perfect, because he can't use sleep. And then he's arrested, and then he just never heals. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I instantly just thunder waved him right off the bat, and now there's nothing, like, he can't heal up. Nice. Good yeah, call. Buddy. Good call. It's a nice move. Yeah, it is, actually. Yeah, uh, let's see. Wait, or... that Snorlax knows Lick? Since when can Snorlax learn that attack? No, I don't need Seedra. Tangela. Does Tangela evolve? Nah. What's 115 in your Pokedex, then? Chansey, Tangela, I don't know. 
Oh, I can. I need to evolve my Star You. That's what I need to do. Star You. Star You. Star You. Star You. Star You Waru. Oh, hey, don't trip. Stand still. There we go. No, nope, still missing. Nope. Have you noticed how difficult it is to fight a Doug Trio? Uh, no, actually. <laughs> it's ridiculous. I think you're just bad. No. I want to find a shiny Doug Trio. What do you think he would look like? He gets a purple nose. Or, uh, sorry, blue nose. He gets blue nose. So they have a little blue snubs. So you were complaining that you got uncool shinies, and now you're asking to find possibly one of the most uncool shinies possible. Uh, yeah. All right, makes sense. I like it. <laughs> Please, is that a question? Really? Yeah. And Charizard! I thought well, my game froze for a second, but then I realized I accidentally right-clicked the Pokemon thingy as well, and I was like, oh. Yes. We won't be needing Rapid Spin. Level 15 already? Yeah, you won't need Harden. Bye. Let's I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get my star me before you know it. Sand Slash. What level does he evolve to star me at anyway? Cause that's uh, my one I don't even have either. I don't know. Is he Waterstone? I really hope not. I don't think so. No, I don't think so at all. Yeah, but that, that is one Pokemon I do need. Thank you for reminding me. I actually don't have Starmie. Yeah, I'm gonna finish it off here. Hey, Geodude, go away. I'm running away from you. You're wasting my time. I'm getting set up perfectly, buddy. Yeah, I'm in the desert, because usually there's some high levels in here that I can just smoke and get quick, quick XP's, but I guess not. Oh, Sand Slash, here we go. Yeah, I'm in the desert right now, but I'm just finding level 30s. There we go, 44. Run away. Cause what I'm... happened to when the Flygons used to just roam the land around our spawn? Uh, I think we murdered them all. They don't want to come back. They're scared. <laughs> They're too scared of me? They know that their muscles? ancestors never made it back, so they don't want to do it again. They're scared of my muscles. My muscles. They're too strong. They have very strong muscles. <laughs> How strong are their muscles? They're very, very strong. Oh, by the way, that's a Flygon, and he's going to be all for me. Oh, really? You found a Flygon? Yep. You're not even going to share him? Nope. Hmm. And That's he's level 49. This is going to be some nice XP. <laughs> Let's see. Hydro right, pump to the face syndrome? Yep, sounds about right. Oh, I am level 54 on my Dragonair. I'm so close. Nice. Jeez. I don't think this day would ever come with Dragonair. What? Okay. Oh, okay. 22. Looks like my adventure with him might actually end very soon. Really? It's an emotional moment, I guess. Don't let it end. Oh, it's gonna end as soon as it comes Dragonite. Don't let it end, Jerome. You're not gonna keep Dragonite in your party? I don't know. I, I still have to figure out my party. Yeah, same, actually. Like, my party, I, I have like, a lot of cool Pokemon I like and all, but can't keep all of them. Yeah. I've already got Gyarados in there. He's like my dragon. Yeah, I like uh, a lot of my Pixelmon, but it's like my party's so weird. I have Mewtwo. That way, if I come across bosses and stuff, like high levels, I can, I can murderize them no matter what. I've got Scyther so I can catch any Pokemon. And then I have Charizard and Blastoise because it's Charizard and Blastoise. Oh, yeah, exactly. And then I don't really know what to do with the other ones. I got Dragonite Delete. for now. Hmm. Delete him. Delete him? Yes. Probably. Put him in the PC and just delete him. Yeah, I think you're right. Hey, I found where Quentin moved his house to. He moved it to his backup home. Really? I think that's where his official home is now. So he, he, he couldn't finish the renovations? He had to migrate? Yeah, the renovations are just taking forever. <laughs> you know, I think we should do this one episode, Mitch. I think we should make Quentin's day and reverse grief and remake his house for him. Yeah, but what do you mean reverse grief? He was renovating. He gave up. Oh, on sorry. It. Well, maybe we should finish the renovations for him. <laughs> maybe. I'll think about it. I think it'd make for a nice gesture. Yeah. Maybe we should do that next episode. He'd be so confused. Oh, absolutely. And we put signs pretending we trolled him. <laughs> like, ha, take this fish. Lo, 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 lo. <laughs> oh, God. And then at the very end, put love Ian. Yes. I like this. The master plan. I like this a lot. I like it even more. 
Then you know what then I just what? realized would be the biggest anti in Pixelmon. What's that? To see a shiny, but it's engaged in a fight with another Pixelmon, and then that other Pixelmon kills it. Oh my god! I would, I would, I'd shut the game off for the day. Like, cause that is possible. No, it is. Yeah, I mean, I, I would literally just shut the game off for the day. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, my answer is pretty concrete. <laughs> that would be too much. Too much. Oh my god. I wouldn't even know how to react. Exactly. There are so many bats here. I'm leaving. That's good though. I do not want any part of that. Well, I mean, bats I'm gonna quickly... build strong bones. Star you. Whoa. Hey, that's a chancy. Aren't those things like rare or some? Yeah, I got one already, but they are rare. Oh, okay. Thunder wave. My gosh. Good thing I checked. You're right, it is a water stone. It is? Yeah. Jeez. Well, I would have been a pretty firm knock-knocking if I didn't yeah, look that up. Yeah, for real. Oh, my God, Mitch. I would have just kept power leveling and power leveling and been like, oh, you're level 40 and you still haven't evolved? Well, pff, guess there's a glitch. That would have been disappointing, man. Yeah. So. Well, buddy, once I catch this Chansey, I think I'm ready to call this video quits, and that means on tomorrow's episode, I can get myself a dragon height. And that also means I can finish a star you into star me, because now I gotta go get a water stone. That's good. That's really good. Well, wish me luck on this one. He already, he already broke through one. I'm getting more and more testy by the second, Mitch. You could do this. Uh, no, no, I might have to. No, no, no. There's no hyperbeam to the face today. He got the vaccine. He got the vaccine. It doesn't help. No, the chance he had the vaccine from it helps. You can't do it. I don't know. I think I'm going to do it. No, no. He had the vaccine. Jerome, Jerome. No, no one instructs me. Yeah, I think I might do it. That Chansey took the vaccine. Just give it a chance, okay? Mitch, I hear something. I don't know what it is, but it sounds like a knock-knock. No. It's a Chansey. Jerome, Jerome. I could be wrong. Wait. There it is again. Either that or maybe it's one of those indoor woodpeckers, but most likely it's a knock-knock. <laughs> I think knock -knock. it's an indoor woodpecker. I don't know, man. It could be either one, but I think knock-knock to Chansey. I think hyperbeam time. <laughs> if you're gonna hyperbeam it, you should run and put it in your Pixelmon Pokedex first. Think I can do that? Yeah, you could do. You could use. Logic. Oh yeah, Nido King escaped. Right click, Chansey. Oh, would you look at that? What are the chances? All right, now who here? Wait, none of my Pokemon have hyperbeam. I don't think that are with me at least. Wow. Oh, thank God. Gyarados has it. I decided to mix things up a bit, so I hydro pumped him first, and now hyper beam. There we go. <laughs> Absolutely destroyed. Wait, your Gyarados knows hydro pump? Yeah. What? He, Betty, Betty knows a lot of t tips and tricks. Oh my gosh, Betty's too powerful. But anyway, guys, I want to thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to click that like button. Let us know you want to see more, and of course, stay tuned for future episodes. Yeah, buddy. Thanks so much for watching. And we'll see you dudes all tomorrow with some more Pixel Mom. Bye. Go for 15,000 likes.